I wouldn't send my children into the industry, for sure. I think I always knew it wasn't, like I did not go into acting as a child for some great love as a child. Um, the, in the family, we all sort of worked and, and acting was the industry. Um, and I was always more the student. Um, my sister, my older sister, Tracy, who's also was an actress and is an actress still, very much in her, in her um, wheelhouse. But for me, I'm much more of an introvert. Well, Benson ended when I was 16, and I started when I was eight, and then I returned to normal school for junior and senior year, and um, and I I then had an offer to um, test for a soap opera, um, and you know how for testing you have to contract before you even do it, and and I thought no, this will interfere with what I want. you cannot have that type of experience without giving pause and being thoughtful and reflective about what it was and especially as a mother myself looking at the choices I can understand the choices as an adult now that my parents made that were appropriate for that moment for them and and really I was fortunate I was very fortunate I have heard stories of people having really, really difficult experiences. And I credit my parents to some degree that it was a positive, but we were just lucky. Um, it's a risky endeavor. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't send my children into the industry, for sure. And they really nurtured me and supported me. And, you know, so often I'd spend my days in my dressing room and people would come in and visit. And I think of it these days in my practice where I'm a psychologist and I'm sort of doing the same thing. I'm in my room and people come in and um, visit. For adults who go into the entertainment industry and have success, I think psychologically to have that experience of celebrity is complicated. And to do it as a child, you know, when, when, when your mind is forming, it's so complicated and you know, on some, like, like, as I was saying, here you are a child assuming an adult role, but it's the role of an actor, which, pardon me actors, but often on set, the actors are very much infantilized. And so it's complicated to then develop a real sense of self and who am I? And, and, and you know, I see it for myself and what my experience was but it helps and forms for me sort of my work with all of my patients.